Hey, what's going on? Welcome to CES 2020, where we're looking at the MSI Creator 17 Mini LED. In all aluminum body, MSI making some really awesome improvements to their Creator line. So if you're interested in that, you're in the right place. We're gonna jump into this content right now. If you're new to the channel, my name is Benji Kaiser. This is where you're gonna find the best tech and tools for graphic designers and creative professionals. So if that sounds like your kind of place, consider subscribing and ring the bell so you don't miss out on any of the future content. If you're curious about the exact specs or prices of this model, you can head down into the description below, click one of those links. If you do use that link, I will get a small commission but at no extra cost to you. And that's what keeps this channel alive and the helpful content coming your way. Today, like I said, we're looking at the MSI Creator 17. Love this, a wide computer, big bold screen, Great color accuracy. If you're gonna be a video editor or graphic designer looking to up your game, get a new computer, whatever it might be, this is a great one. We're gonna talk through this right now. First of all, we're gonna jump into the trackpad. The trackpad is something that, like I've said on my channel historically, I don't like talking about too much because most people don't do it well. Well, MSI this year has been bringing out some fantastic trackpads. It's actually in my top three favorite running with the Acer Concept D, the MacBook Pro, and then these MSI trackpads. Really good click, nice touch sensitivity. Moving up to the keyboard, it's got good press, good spacing between the keyboard, nice soft keys, kind of a spongy feel, which personally I like. I don't like too stiff, hard, chunky keys, so they've done that really well. You have a webcam, so if you're somebody doing meetings a lot, no worries there. You'll be able to do those meetings, get that webcam in place. It's got DCPI color accuracy, which if you're not sure exactly what that is, it is similar to the Adobe RGB color accuracy, so very color accurate screen. So we're talking about the Creator 17, and I brought Jordan on to discuss the mini LED. Why is this such a big development in the landscape of laptop screens? So I'm going to pass it over to Jordan. He's going to break down the Creator 17 mini LED versus the previous generation. Thank you. So this is actually the world's first uh, mini LED laptop. Basically, it has 240 mini LED zones that's on the back of the, the panel. And every time uh, a light or like, let's say, a really black uh, color that is shown out, it will actually dim down all the lights at that section to make it really, really dark, which is really close to like OLED. Um, but however, this actually has an HDR of over 1,000 standard so that means it can actually produce over 1100 nits okay. that gives you a lot brighter color a lot more vibrant and as you can see you can kind of tell that the contrast between the black and the colors there's many many details in it if you want to compare uh, from this to an OLED it would OLED is roughly around 80 percent to 90 percent of DCI-P3 okay. But this definitely has a higher uh, accuracy than, than that. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. And it's just crazy to see the developments in the screen. So we go from this over here, uh, which is full HD, you know, pretty sharp, until you then come over to the newest model and you just see the contrast between the highlights and the dark tones like Jordan was talking about. So thanks so much for walking us through that. All right, so looking at the screen thing, one thing that I am not stoked about, it's not a huge killjoy, but if you notice, the screen has a really good hinge, but it gets a little stiff as we go to open back up. Um, something that I, feel, that I feel people have a bit of a preference for, they want a bit of a smoother screen, but overall, super impressed. It's got great hinges, really low screen flex. We'll check that out there. Really great uh, build quality here. Like I said, all aluminum body, so really chasing after that MacBook Pro all aluminum, thin, light laptop. So MSI doing a great job here. This machine does come with the i9, so whether you're a video editor, graphic designer, motion designer, this is going to have the power you need to handle those tasks. If you have any further questions, you can always head down in the comment section below, hit me up. I'm super active there. I'd love to answer your questions. If you're curious about the exact pricing and deeper specs of this model, head down in the description below, grab one of those links that is an affiliate link. So if you do use that, I will get a small commission, but at no extra cost to you. Thanks for joining us at CES 2020. Ring the bell, subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the future videos coming at you here for Creative Professionals. Talk to you guys later.